heading out to the mountains again. I'm gonna take my Leica M3, a roll of film, and take a few snaps. Come along if you're into it. If you wanna see some mountains and stuff like that. Whoa, there it is, 2004. So I ended up shooting this roll by accident uh, at 25 ISO. So I had to pull the film two stops. Never done that before. I've done a ton of film development where I'm pushing, but never pulling. So this was a 100 ISO film, it's T-Max 100, and I'm used to shooting 400, and I just totally screwed up. So basically, I ended up shooting the whole roll like that because I, I knew what I did and I had to continue throughout the whole roll. But it actually worked out pretty good. I'll tell you what my development times were in a second, but it seemed to work out totally fine. Anyway, here's some images and a quick trip into the mountains. So here's another epic location. I like to fly fish, so I figured this might work while I'm out here and I'll take a shot of this stunning spot and see how it turns out okay guys I don't know if you can hear me it's really loud down here and I don't want to drop the light in here's the scene anyway we're in the woods somewhere and uh, doing a little fly fishing I got a little, I got a tripod set up for the Leica and that's the scene I got my fly fishing reel in the foreground and we'll see how it turns out I think I'm at F16, what am I at, F16, uh, 1 15th is what I'm going to set it at. All right, we'll get right back to you here. I think we'll do a selfie here. Timer mode with the Leica. Good spot. So the film I'm using today is T-Max 100 and is expired film. It's from 2004. The only thing I've done to these shots was a bit of dodging and burning in Photoshop. I don't know if you can hear me. It's pretty nice in there. But I don't really have a foreground subject. I mean, some of these flowers are pretty cool, but I don't know if I'd get that. Nice spot. Here's a cool spot. We're right on the river here. Runoff is done. So the water looks, well, it's drinkable for sure. Uh, you can see for yourself. So I might, uh, I don't know if you can hear me, but it's pretty epic here. It's pretty sunny too. It's, it's kind of late evening and I just think I'll get a shot in here with my Leica and put a two-stop ND filter on it, see if I get something interesting here. But it is gorgeous. If I had a uh, polarizer on this, you'd see, you can see right to the bottom. And like I said, you can drink this stuff. Anyway, I'll be right back with hopefully some photos. It's pretty dark down here, but the mountains are light. Pretty nice spot. So I'm gonna do a uh, photo here using the road as the foreground subject and of course the mountain in the background. But check these clouds out, pretty awesome. 
I'm going to take two shots, one just standard lens, the Summicron 50, and then I'm going to put a two-stop red filter on it because these clouds look awesome. Again, that mountain is much closer than it is, but you're looking at it through my, my phone, which is about a 24 mil. Anyway, pretty sweet. This first shot is with the red filter on it, and you can see it really pulls out the white clouds and the blue sky. What's cool about the 50 mil that I have on the Leica today is it's kind of close to what your eye sees. So I don't know if you've ever had to, um, if you're taking a shot and say, wow, this looks beautiful, and then you stick your phone up there, and the background is like 100 miles away. It's because it was at probably around 24 mil. So with the 50, like right now, I think this is at about 24 mil. But that hill, everything's much closer to me and it will be pretty close to what the Leica sees with the 50 mil on it. So the development I did, I used Ilford HC 1 to 31, and usually for this film, which again is T-Max 100, it's 7.5 minutes. So I just took 25% off that. So basically just over six and a half minutes. At the six and a half minute mark, I started dumping it. Uh, oh yeah, agitated every minute for 10 seconds. Turned out pretty good. I'm happy with it. Yeah, I was a little bit worried, but uh, it came out okay. Here we are in another cool location. And from higher elevation, this water was like emerald green. It's epic. We're in Banff, Alberta. Maybe I'll get a shot here. The beavers are busy here. That's a pretty big dam.